it is with great pleasure that I, on behalf of the government, people and the armed forces of India, welcome all the members of the United States Army. So like, do you have a hand signal for like... To actually do well, There's no better symbol to our commitment to this region's security than the U.S. soldiers working alongside our Indian partners. This exercise provides an excellent opportunity for professional and cultural exchange as we train and learn together. During the next two weeks, our combined Indian-U.S. team will exchange ideas, experiences through expert lectures, realistic training, and a complex command post exercise. Yudh Abhyas will become a landmark event in the history of our bilateral relations and we shall continue to work together and take our traditional friendship to the newer heights. Our great armies have proved their mettle in the past and we have a lot to learn from each other. Thank the Indian Army for inviting us to train together with these highly skilled soldiers of the 11th Jack Rifles and here at the Mahaja Field Firing Range. presence here today is a demonstration of America's steadfast commitment and we are grateful for the strong enduring military partnership between the world's largest democracies. Now we are coming for that time. We share your perspectives about countering terrorism with a firm conviction and joint determination. We have to break the nexus between the terrorism weapons of mass destruction, and drug trafficking. We find ourselves in a challenging, uncertain times during this global pandemic that has greatly affected both our countries. So we are especially grateful to be able to continue this essential ex exercise, even in this difficult period. Threats to our shared security remain present even during a pandemic. So our partnership must remain equally persistent and stronger than ever.